If you have a Delta Peerless style faucet and you have a leak, I'll share a couple troubleshooting tips. So first we need to take off the handle to get to the cartridge and depending on the, which style you have, like this one has a little set screw off to the side, others you would remove a little cap on the top and then remove a screw and that allows you to pull off the handle. Once you're here you're going to have some type of retaining nut and I just like using a channel lock and we can just grab this and loosen it. Now this nut is covered by this handle so I don't care about scratching this but if you're worried about scratching the metal you can do a couple things. One is you can wrap a little bit of electrical tape on the teeth here and that'll prevent it from scratching. Also I like to use tubing. You go to the hardware store, buy a little bit of tubing, bring your tool with you that would just slide over it. They'll cut you a little piece and that does a nice job because it really grabs it too. Once you remove your nut you can get to the cartridge. And so there's a couple things once we have this cartridge. If you're leaking out of the handle, if you have a slow drip and it's coming out of the handle, you're going to replace the O-ring. So bring this with you to the hardware store. They're going to pull this O-ring off, replace this, and then you want to use a little plumber's grease on this. When you push this back in, if there's any buildup of rust in there or particles, mineral deposits, it can scratch that O-ring and then it'll leak again. So a little bit of plumber's grease, pop it in, and that'll solve your leak out of the handle. Now if it's leaking out of the spout, what we have to do is get to the seat in the bottom. So just taking a little piece of metal, we're going to reach in and just pull out this seat. And the seat has a spring attached to it, so this is two parts. And you can see that we have the spring and the rubber seat. And this sets right on it like this and this sets right on the bottom of the cartridge. So as we turn the cartridge and we turn it to where the hole is, that allows water to pass through. When we turn the handle and now the seat is against that flat piece of metal, it turns off the water flow. So what this does is this over time, again with rust and mineral deposits, it put little scratches in this. So the first thing we want to do is just buy a new kit. It's going to have two seats and two springs and we're going to replace the seat. Now if it's still leaking after that, then we'll have to replace the whole cartridge. But pretty easy to solve a leak. If it's out of the handle, replace the O-ring. If it's coming out of the spout, first you're going to change and replace the seat. If that doesn't solve it, then just grab a new cartridge.